Welcome back, more Pokemon Shield Snowman Edition. We are to go to a restaurant and find our good friend Sonya, Big Bob's uncle or whatever. It might be this one, because you know, that looks like a guy that would name Big Bob. So we'll check it out. Having a great time, hope you are so far. Uh, we fixed correctly. There's all of our good friends. Got the gym badge normal girl, nice one. Oh, hey, there you are. I've been trying to find out more about the Darkest Day and the Sword and Shield Pokemon, but still no luck. Got us the tapestry. Wait, hold on. There's another one right next to Big Bob. I'm pretty sure that that's not the kind of like tapestry Big Bob would have next to his restaurant. I actually guarantee it. No, wait, what's this? A new chapter in the old Galar Legends. The heroes look sad, and where are the sword and shield? It's like they don't have a sword or a shield. What was the meaning of this picture? Uh, some kind of seal. <laughs> I don't know what that means. I'd rather look at the Big Bob picture, to be honest. Uh, you think so? I guess it would be that they were sealed away. Maybe they've gone into some kind of sleep. I don't know how you would get that out of that, but hey, it's cool. Based on the statues we saw back in Stow Inside, the sword and the shield were actually two Pokemon, right? That's right. That's my take on it, at least. Wasn't there a sword and shield Pokemon in Gen 6? I think we're a little late now. You remember the Pokemon we met that day? Do you think it could have been one of them? Either the sword or the shield Pokemon? You met them? Come on, you know what I'm talking about, right, Normie Girl? Uh, the Slumbering Wield? Yes, I do. The Fog Man. And by Fog Man, I mean Fog Dog. Exactly. The mad Pokemon we ran into in Fog. Don't you think you could have been it? Uh, sure. Uh, that's right. You lot have been in the Slumbering Wield. I've only started on this journey because my grand told me to, but this is turning out to be too much fun. You gotta tell me more. How about we discuss over a meal? Go on. What do you want to eat? Let's get our orders in. I wonder what Big Bob's got. I bet he's got nice burgers here. No tomatoes though, please. Tomatoes are in the burger. Fascinating. Alright, the next thing do to do now that we're done eating is to have a look around and search. I wanted to eat! I wanted to like pick, go to the restaurant and pick and eat and sit around and eat like breadsticks and stuff. And I'm mad that we didn't get to do that. Uh, let's inspect the hero's bath. <laughs> what are you saying, Sonya? What are you trying to say, Sonya? Uh, the food here is out of this world. It's worth coming here just for this, even if it means going out of your way. I wouldn't know. I mean, I guess uh, I ate them, but I, w I wouldn't know about it. You must have a proper meal at roast if you want to have a proper battle. Absolutely, I agree. We're not talking to these chefs, they'll try to fight me. Talking about work during a meal, what are you trying to do, ruin your own food? Absolutely none of that. Absolutely adore watching my child eat. Okay, he looks so happy and content. Can I watch him eat, or would that be weird? Uh, this is dishes cooked to perfection. It's juicy, but not overly soft, and gives you something to really bite into. I must send the cook my compliments. I'm pretty sure this small child will not say that like that. And uh, look how out of place this tapestry is. Maybe it's not too out of place. It has like grease on it. There's like grease stains up here. Like they kind of throw hamburgers at it occasionally. Big Bob or whatever. He's having a good time. Look at him how jolly he is. Okay, well, we gotta go. <clears throat> kind of planned to spend more time at Big Bob's bakery there, but it didn't happen. I guess we're gonna go take a hero's bath. Just right here in the middle of town. Nothing wrong with that. Hero's bath. To say this is where the two heroes came to soothe their wounds after the battle to bring down that evil presence long ago. Nowadays, only Pokemon really use the bath, though. Hmm, who exactly were the heroes that bathed here? Can I bathe there? I want to. I think I'll have to look into that. Me and Sonya could bathe there. Together. Moving on. You two met a mysterious Pokemon back in the slumbering wheel. Perhaps you two can become new heroes. What? Like some hero waving around a sword and shield? Fill the other one. Tough, I guess. I'd fancy a sword if I had to take my pick. I mean, I think most people would. But I'm going with a shield because I'm a uh, shield guy. What kind of battle do you think the heroes had back then? Probably use a sword. Hop, stop. You're getting weird again. Why don't we show her, normal girl? Think we can pull off a real heroic battle? If I have to, sure. Sonya treated us to a great meal after that. Uh, Curry, we can get energy to wrestle a beware. Okay. I don't entirely understand your reasoning, but I might as well just see what you can do. I'll heal your Pokemon up for you, normal girl. So get it your best. Thank you, Sonya. I would prefer to like get in the hero's best hot spring, but I guess we'll just do this. Maybe one day. Pokemon Trainer Hop, are you going to beat me this time? Double. 
God, it's got horns and stuff now. Big cheeks ain't scared. I'm counting on you, partner. Okay, we got the hell damage coming in. Don't worry about that. Just use your body slam. God, he's faster than me. No, big cheeks. You took damage, but almost as much as he did. Bodyslam.com. You love to see it. God, I'm so smart for giving it a shell bell. Impressed yet with my Pokemon skill? I knew you would be. You're using Growl at level 45? Okay. I can see why you lost to Bead and Ice Lady. Just kidding. Ice Lady was hard, but Bead wasn't. You're a failure hops, what I'm saying. That's mean of me, isn't it? Just don't tell him I said that. Okay, what else you got for me? Cinder Ace. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna switch Pokemon. Can I use my bird? I'm using my bird Pokemon. I hope it doesn't die. It also looks kind of dorky, but I love it. It's cute like that. Okay, we're gonna go with a Drill Peck. You got the first hit, Mega Kick. I thought this thing was flying. Why is Mega Kick doing so much damage to it? Maybe I'm just bad. Okay, we're gonna swiftly remove this man. And we'll put out, uh, I don't know, whatever. A real Pokemon, I guess. I've not had a solid sixth Pokemon for a while. Toxicroak probably could have been it, but it died prematurely. Happens, I guess, right? I'm not sure how good our, uh, Water bird will be because apparently you can't take a mega kick. Look, Gyarados just dodged it. Gyarados ain't scared. Now that's a proper move. Yeah, it's it's a water attack against your fire dude. I've learned this ten years ago, twenty years ago, something like that. Oh, okay, sorry about that. Just dated myself. Uh, Pin Ker Chin. I don't know what that is. What is a pinker chin? Just sing out, long boy. Thank you for that. What is that? That's gonna poison me, isn't it? Well, I'm gonna flame it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, that wasn't very good. Oh, it's electric. How? How could I be forgiven for not knowing that? I feel that like, and I think I've said this before, like the older generations, you could look at a Pokemon and tell what top it was, and now it's just like a guessing game. I mean, I guess that's bound to happen after like 4,000 Pokemon. Gary wants to learn Hurricane. What does Hurricane do? Use your attacks by wrapping its opponent in a fierce wind that flies up in the sky. So may also confuse the target. So it's a Hydro Pump, right? He has even less accuracy than Hydro Pump, but we're just... I don't think it's worth learning that. I think I'll just keep Hydro Pump and not learn Hurricane. But kind of hurts because, you know, Hurricane is cool, but I don't think we need it. Corvin well, your flying boy. Now this would be nice to have my whatever. Never mind, I'm just using words. Let's just send this out. Hopefully, it can deal with it. Because uh, my fire insect Pokemon cannot do that. Corviknot. Is it still? Po is that a steel Pokemon? We ain't going to be eating no berries. I'll tell you that. Fake out. That didn't do very much. Um, something tells me this fight's not going to go very well. Uh, extra sensory. Not even the real kind of sensory. The normal kind of sensory. We got extra senses. I don't say that every time I use that attack, promise. Drill pack, please don't kill me. Okay, well, this is not going very well. 
I need an electric Pokemon. I think. I would not mind having an electric Pokemon. I will say that. I don't know that we'll ever get one, though. We can just... We can just grind hop down. But... Would not mind having an electric Pokemon. Like right now, I have nothing to really switch into it. Dozy's best attacks can't even hit it. Whatever. Big cheeks don't care. We need a Pikachu on the team, is what I'm saying, okay? Or does T needs to use more scary bases and growls. All right, big cheeks. Now's your time to shine. I don't. It's a it's a it's a steel Pokemon, right? But Bison's gonna suck. I don't think it's gonna matter, but you know, we should be able to kill it next time. It'll probably still go before me because my speed fell. My speed sucks anyway. But um, our new bird Pokemon definitely can't take the hit. I need, I would like to find a good solid six Pokemon, okay? It's almost the end of the game, maybe, not sure, but we don't have a good six party member. I want a Galvantula. You make it happen, Game Freak. It's, even, it's not even still Game Freak, is it? Dozy wants Slam. Do we want to teach it Slam? Slam has like a shitty, doesn't even hit. Sandstorm sucks though. I don't think so. I'm never gonna use Sandstorm. Like, my team does not take advantage of Sandstorm at all. Okay, is the fight over yet? Snorlax. Um, I don't think Dozy's gonna do very well, but you know. He needs his time to shine, okay? He may always be sleepy and stuff, but don't hate him. Think you got me cornered, not even close. I'll be the greatest when I steal this win back. He does have a Snorlax. I would not mind having a Snorlax. It is only level 39. That being said, I'm not that much far ahead of it. Let's see how Bulldoze works. Please two shot it. It's not going to two shot it. But we did, we did do things. Don't kill me. Okay, well that's like. We'll just trade hits, I guess. Unless he crits me and I die and I get mad. But you know, that happens. Shouldn't happen, but it happens, okay? Remember that time my Toxic Croak died and I cried? Remember that time my good team died and I had to use a bunch of other Pokemon that were kind of good, but probably not as good as what I did have? Uh, the fate of Nuzlocke. I kind of just want to hang out in Big Boss all day, but that's not where we're at, I guess. It took years to kill him. Still can't beat you, my true arrival, but I think I'm starting to see the light. Thank you for your money, friend. Can we get in the bathtub yet, Sonya? Thanks, you two gave a right proper battle at the rate you both are going. Even the unbeatable Leon may be in trouble. So what's next, you two? I plan to look into the things in the slumbering wheel. I guess that's what we're doing now, too. I'm going to keep challenging that gym. Then once I get that gym badge, I'll be heading to Route 9 to take on Spike. Oh, yeah, never mind. We're not going to Slumbering Wheel yet. We're going to go to Spike Muth. Spike Muth. I don't know. Seems like he finally shook off that gloom. Leon worry if Hop wasn't feeling all right. As his rival, you wouldn't like it either, right? See ya. Darn tootin', Sonya. I couldn't have him depressed and stuff. I gotta have him doing ADHD things. All right, well, uh... I've gotten trapped at the bath place. Anyways. Can we can I go back in? Please, okay. Never mind. Have I been in this house? I don't think I've ever been in this house. Green coat man, I have never seen you. I want to have my fringe blown to the side in a hair salon too. <laughs> I'll see what you did there. It's it's funny because he's bald. Did I miss the barbershop? 
We never went to the barbershop. Was there one here? There was a barbershop that I did not go to. I remember it. Where was it? There it is. You can talk to these business ladies. Nothing like fire tops for icy towns. I'm toasty one thanks to Sizzler Pete. I have one of those, maybe. I stops a perfect fit for icy towns. Absolutely. Let's go look at these hairs. Welcome, lovely to see you. What would you like to do today? I'm rich, I don't care. Hair. What you got for me? Like, let's see here. We got the medium curls. Do I have to click it? Yes. I don't know if medium curls are for normie, normie girl. There's like no new hairstyles. I thought there would be new stuff here. We may have wasted our money. Because I think Norma Girl likes the short bob, okay? I don't think we want anything else in here. This is too prissy for Norma Girl, okay? We're gonna go with the short bob, and I wasted $3,000. It's fine. It's fine. I thought there would be more haircuts. There's not. Yeah. Just thank you for taking all of my money. At least she's happy about it. Man, she's happy to have nothing done. You know what else we can do? We can look at the makeup. I've never looked at the makeup because normal girl, she's too normy for that shit, but we're gonna look at it now. Normal eyebrows. We want the thick eyebrows? Oh, no, probably not. Thin eyebrows? No, we're gonna go with the normals because we're normie girl. Uh, we want the dark brown. No, we want the caramel blonde. Oh God, I've messed up the whole time. We have to have the caramel blonde eyelashes to match us, okay? Has to be. What is this? Oh my. What do we do? Do we go with the cat eye? Do we go with the natty? Or do we go with this thing? It depends on how many like spikes we want on our eyes. I think that's probably too much. Yeah, normie girls normie. We don't want that. What are these? Are these eye colors? Well, we got brown going on. What color would we want? We want hey, oh god. She can see right through my soul with that. Gray? No, she's dead inside there. Uh we could go with the hell blue. We what was that, brown? Brown's normal. Like normie girl. Purple? No, she's on drugs there. Um, ultramarine. What is that? What is that ultramarine? That is spooky. That's sp Oh, God. We're getting down to, like, the fancy stuff now. Oh, my. She was possessed in this one. And I thought we were on drugs before. <laughs> Never mind. What in the world? <laughs> Gotta go. What did I sh Okay, dude. Okay. So we can go with brown. Or we can go with pale blue. Or the gray. Where does it gonna go with the brown? So we succeeded in changing our eye color. Or by eye color, I mean eyebrow color. We want some lipstick. Oh God, we might want the pale pink. We could impress Leon and he, he never, it's so subtle he would never know. Oh, by the way, I never thought I would be, you know, playing dress up and, you know, YouTube Pokemon game, but you know, here we are. We're, okay, we, guys, will we go with the pale pink? It's just subtle enough. Leon would never even know. I think we're gonna go for it. We're gonna go for the pale pink. Yep, it's perfect. We got the right eyebrows. We got the pale pink. He'll never, it's so subtle, he'll never know, but he'll be enamored with us, right? Now we have matching eyebrows. We got the, we got the pale pink lipstick. No man could resist us, let alone a man with a cape like that. And we look fresher than the mint, the lady said, so I only gave her like 4,000 gold to do that. That's fine. It's not 4,000 gold, I'm, that's too much World of Warcraft playing. It's 4,000 uh, poke dollars slash money. I don't, I don't know, whatever it is. Where's Route 9 at? 
Where's Route 9? Is my Pokemon healed? No. Sonya, I thought you were going to heal my Pokemon and you did not. She was trying to make me walk into a trap. Did you see that? But, uh, yeah. We didn't really do much here. But we, we went to Big Bob's. So, you know, that's the highlight of the series. Going to Big Bob's Burgers. And, uh... Uh... Yeah, Big Bob's Burgers. And we got our hair done for Leon. Where's Route 9? This is not Route 9. This is where we came in. Route 9 is probably over here somewhere. You know, that would be logic and stuff. Please. Okay. Okay, I found my way successfully. Anyways, uh, Route 9 awaits us ahead. The Cold Abyss. And Spikemuth. Muth. I don't know how to pronounce it. Anyways, uh... Normal girl's having fun with the snow here. That's so cute. She really just wants to show off her new hair and makeup. Everybody, uh, you know, leave comments if you tell her you think it looks good. You know, she, she has self-esteem issues sometimes. So she would really appreciate it. 